Hello Pisces, welcome to Femacy Lighthouse, welcome to my channel, welcome to your energy reading. Today we'll be talking about a connection, a person that you can't seem to get off of your mind, okay? We'll be taking a look at the past, the present, and the future in reference to this person. I want to remind you, not every, look at that, look at all these cards coming out. Not every Pisces watching this is going to identify with this message. These are general messages. They are not personal readings. Please follow me on Instagram. That link is in the description box below. I provide you with a lot of personal insight into what's going on astrologically. And I do personal horoscopes. I also have a lot of stuff going on, all right? So I'm a model and I also am a musician. And I think if I'm reading for you, then it's important for you to get to know me on a personal level, okay? So let's go ahead and talk about the past here. Okay, so I have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Aries energy, and I also have... Sagittarius and Leo energy. And we have your energy, Pisces energy with the Queen of Cups here. Okay. So in the past position, I feel like you took a gamble and you took a risk. You gave somebody an opportunity. You gave somebody a chance. And now you just see that it might have not been the best gamble. It may have not been the best risk to take okay you keep looking back at this issue okay and i feel like your person keeps looking back at someone from their past which is why it's difficult for them to truly give you what you want and i see that in the past position you have always adored this person you have always felt this connection with this individual but now there's a lot of competition there's a lot of conflict i feel like your person is very handsome very beautiful whether male or female they have a lot of options you're aware of that this person could be in the commercial eye somehow works in the community someone who just has a lot of suitors this person could be an in, in entertainment entertainer is is what i'm also getting all right um so that's what i have for the past position but we're going to clarify now let's take a look at the present please talk to me about the present and who it is that pisces is dealing with in the present moment i know something was gonna fall hold on one second please Okay. All right, so in the present moment, we have Taurus energy here with the Hierophant being present or a part of the situation that has to do with your person, Pisces, okay, with the Hierophant card. Please speak to me in reference to Pisces and their person. This is something that I feel is hidden from you. Okay, perhaps your person could be interested in a Taurus or an earth sign and they have feelings for this person. And this is something that you may be unaware of. Okay, there are definitely some secrets here. We also have Virgo energy. Tell me more about the person that Pisces is dealing with, please. Tell me more. Tell me more about the person. The Knight of Cups, okay? So they definitely have a lot of emotion. Let's see who they have a lot of emotion for. Who does Pisces person have a lot of emotion for, okay? So again, secrets, secrets that are about to be revealed. But I do feel like they generally have a lot of love for you too, Pisces, right? They're just trying to figure out which way to go. 
they're confused, okay? But I still pick up on them wanting someone that's in their surrounding energy, okay? I get this. You see how he's looking back at her? You see what I'm saying with the Hierophant? Let's talk about the future when it comes to Pisces and their person. Please speak to me in reference to the future when it comes to Pisces and the person that they're dealing with. Please talk to me in reference to the future. We have the King of Pentacles, more Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Please speak to me in reference to Pisces and the person who they're thinking of. We have the Two of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Give me one more card. And we have the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Your person has a huge decision to make. They're confused and they don't know which way to go. I feel like they're choosing between you and someone else, Pisces. Okay? Or this could be you choosing between them and someone else. Remember that energy is always transferable. So you have to take it the way it identifies with you. Now let's clarify to see what else your person has on their mind, what they're thinking about. Talk to me about the actions that the person Pisces is dealing with plans on taking. The Queen of Cups. Okay, so there's definitely going to be an emotional conversation between you two that's coming up if you haven't had it already. All right. Queen of Cups is Pisces energy, but it's also a very personal conversation that you guys are going to be having. Okay, so this is the action that they're going to be taking. What is this conversation about? What is this conversation about when it comes to Pisces and the person that they're dealing with? What is this conversation about? Hmm. Okay, so I think that you're noticing that something is off about them. This is Aquarius energy. And you may be the one who is initiating this conversation, right? Because there's some questions that you want answers to is the energy that I get. I feel like you feel their shift. They're not the same with you. It's not the same, right? Why are things not the same between Pisces and their person? Please tell me. Why are things not the same between Pisces and their person? Okay, because with Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy here, okay, I feel like your person, Pisces, feels like they are at a distance from something that they want to do or they're at a distance from some sort of wish that they have, okay? And there's some sort of choice here that they know that they have to make, is what I'm getting. What is the choice? What is the choice that the person that Pisces is dealing with has to make? What is this choice? Okay. There's some sort of ending. And I know it's tough energy. I know that there is something that's really bothering you, Pisces. I get it. You know and you feel that something is just not right with this person. You're absolutely right about that. You guys being one of the most intuitive signs, all right? I feel that you're on point. You know what's up before I even tell you. You already know, okay? A lot of tarot readers are Pisces, okay? And I feel that there's some sort of ending here that's on your person's mind. Tell me more about this ending, please. Tell me more about this ending. Please speak to me in reference to this ending. They're quiet. It's almost as if they're being quiet about the moves that they're trying to make. What moves is Pisces person trying to make? What moves? 
What's going on here? Please speak to me, spirit. What moves? What's the secret here? What is the secret? The secret is some sort of Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. With the Ace of Pentacles, it's like they want to offer something to someone, Pisces. But I feel like you're already onto this. Like, you know. You know there's something up. You know, I would suggest you start looking at this person's social media. Start, you know, looking at what's going on. Take a closer look because something's going on. You know what I'm saying? It's the vibe. It's definitely the vibe that I get. And, and I'm feeling like you. I feel like you already know that this is going on and you're watching this for confirmation. Now let's take a look at the future when it comes to... What's coming for Pisces in the future with this connection? Seven of Cups. It's going to be a lot of confusion, a lot of emotional baggage, okay? Um, I feel like either you want to separate or somebody else does, Pisces, okay? Who wants to separate here? Who is it that wants to separate? Please speak to me in reference to... Who it is that wants to separate. This is Sagittarius energy. And I feel like Sagittarius. If you're dealing with a Sagittarius. Sagittarius is trying to be very strong. All right. It could be this Sagittarius that feels like they have to move on. Why is this passionate person feeling like they have to be so strong. You don't have to be dealing with a sad, but this is somebody who's really passionate about everything that they do. And they're calculated. So although they can be impulsive at times, they are also very methodical and strategic. Okay. King of Wands, Sagittarius energy. All right, so that's what I have for you, Pisces. If you're interested in a private reading with me to verify this situation further or any other situation, you can send me an email and we can schedule a private reading. They are an hour long and we do them FaceTime, Google Duo, or just regular phone conversation. Please follow me on Instagram. That link is below. I want to thank you so much for watching and take care.